it's Kay Jones uh, coming at you with the new series. Thinking about doing it Ultimate Iron Man style. So down below you can see I'm mining on my uh, Iron Man Sarthon. If you haven't seen my Iron Man series, you can check that out on my channel. Uh, basically, <laughs> I'm getting kind of close to max on my Iron Man. I'm not bored, but I have a lot of AFKable skills. And AFKable skills mean that uh, there's a lot of sitting around and I'm starting to run out of shows. And a lot of the Iron Man in my clan chat are like doing some of the really content that is fun, like Underground Pass and Regicide, Mornings in Part 2. You know, all of these really cool, low, lo like mid-level tier stuff. And I really miss it because my Iron Man, as y'all know, is hitting three years old. And so I'm really wanting to kind of reunite myself with the beginning game of RuneScape because it's been three years since I've really started from the beginning. And don't get me wrong, like, I don't... I don't plan to ever quit my Iron Man, and I don't plan to max this account, uh, this ultimate. If it happens one day, it happens. I just sincerely doubt it. I'm doing this for fun and because I really want to enjoy this style and mode of the game. I'm going to be really honest. I hate looting bags, and I don't think I will end up having looting bags on this ultimate, which will make it very interesting. I also don't like suiciding, which will be very interesting because I know that's something that's very important to ultimate. So we're going to go ahead and see how this works out. Um, I don't know how long this series will be or if I will continue and keep it up because I know there's a lot of PVM content that I'm wanting to do on my Iron Man after I max. As you can see, I keep glancing over at the other screen because I'm, I'm on two screens at once. But I'm extremely excited to start this. And if you guys want to make an ultimate for fun and join me, let's do it, guys. Anyway, I kind of already started on this account a little bit. You can see that I've got some levels like woodcutting and cooking and all that. And a lot of that I got to free to play. Well, my friend gave me a bond on my ultimate and I changed the name to K Jones. So now I think I'm going to actually do some really good levels and stuff. I did the cook's assistance. I started M Catcher and I did Restless Ghost, Sheep Shear, and Rune Mysteries. I didn't record any of that because I didn't quite know if I wanted to make a series yet. But I'm only level 13 and I haven't got much done on this account. So I definitely think we're still in the green to start a new series. Let's do this. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm gonna go for the Arty Cloak one because it's a great cape for prayer and just combat and everything. And it will help me get to Arduin uh, pretty easily. And I can do some quests over there and it will be good. Uh, I need some teas for food. And I'm also going to be doing, what is it called? The Stronghold of Security because I set up my authenticator and my bank pin and so we're all Gucci gang on that. So, yeah, I'm going to grab some teas and we're going to do that and then probably start getting over to Arduin and setting all of that up and seeing if we can get that qu that cape today. That'd be pretty dope. I don't know if I'll get it today or how long it's going to take, but the adventure will be interesting. Oh my god, this account looks so cute. Look at me swing that axe. Oh, so sexy. All right, so we're about to start the Stronghold of Security. I'm going to be really freaking honest. I don't remember the paths to get to the center of the rooms. I just know that it's not too difficult. Uh, so this would be interesting. If I die, I will cry, and I can't use the portal. And yeah, Gate of War. We have to answer all these stupid questions. Can I spam through? Oh. Oh, my character said it was creepy. We got level fives, we're good, and I have like no run energy. This is going to be interesting. Um, so yeah. Bro, I just got the flap emote because I'm about to flap that ass, bro. Bro. Blah, 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 blah. Oh dear. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm sorry, I had to continue. I forgot about these really cool creatures in RuneScape. They're called Catabal. Catabol pawns, but they actually look really cool. Like, 
for old school graphics, that actually looks really sick. It says, a big cow-like, but cows don't have serpent tails. Like, that's a sick creature in RuneScape. I wish they would update the graphics. I don't know, even the old graphics are just rememberable. It's pretty cool. And I don't want to die to these mofos, but here we go. Ah, oh, what I g To pass, you must answer this. How do I remove a hijacker from my account? Using the magic skill. <laughs> We're gonna use the magic skill to stop a hijacker. That would be nice, cause my Iron Man, my main is 99 magic. <laughs> Hijackers, just boom, done. Um, bite, oh wrong. Oh, I don't know how to do this. <laughs> Let me through. Ugh. Do respond, don't click any links, yada, yada, yada. Okay, let me through, and I'm probably going to get... Oh, I just tank test that. Boom, shaka, laka, laka. This dude is new, Souls Ton. I just hit the end of the Stronghold Security. I've never seen this dude here. Let's talk to him. Can you hear me? Of course, I'm wearing an amulet of ghost... What? I'm wearing an amulet of ghost speak? <laughs> I forgot I did the restless ghost and I had like no inventory, so I just wore it. What if I, can you hear me? I can, but I'm not wearing an amulet of ghost speak. Am I dead? Okay, so even if I was not wearing an amulet of ghost speak, it would not make a difference. Oh, dude, my haircut's sexy. I want to make this ultimate into a girl character. I just haven't gotten the chance. Can you hear me? I'm wearing an amulet of ghost speak, but it doesn't matter because if I didn't have one on, I could still hear you. I'm no ghost. I'm a spirit. I'm injecting my thoughts into your head. Oh, that's interesting. Also rather disturbing. Try not to think about it. Uh, oh, this guy upgrades the skull scepter. So right now it breaks once all the charges have been used. Show me the treasure and I can imbue it so it can be recharged with any scepter piece. Oh, I didn't read that. That's actually really sick, in case you didn't know that. So, you, the Skull Scepter disappears, but he will hook you up. That's what he's for. Got him. Something I was really thinking of is I should probably do Druidic Ritual before, ooh, leather gloves, motherfucker. Um, I should probably do Druidic Ritual before I go over to Artie because it would unlock Herblore. I'm not saying I'm going to train Herblore. Oh, I already had her leather gloves on. But I think it would be a good thing to just have it unlocked because then I'll have all the skills unlocked. And I can also start Slayer with the Birth Rope Master. So I think I'm going to do that um, first just to start my first Slayer task and to finish that quest um i'm not even sure if i'm a high enough level to complete it but we can try yo let's do it i got my first slayer task it's to kill 39 zombies oh that's a shitty task but you know what can you expect it's turial so so i just realized this guy's name was sandview and there's Sandfuel Serum, you know what I'm saying? That Sandfuel that, like, restores your prayer and your stats and is protection from anti-poison or from poison. I think that's named after him. Bro. Okay, this bear is legitimately killing the crap out of me. <laughs> I need your bear meat. Ah! I'm gonna run out of food. Ah! Ah, okay, 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 okay. Okay, I'm walking away, I'm walking away, bro. Bears in RuneScape, actually hard. Okay, okay, that's enough. I'm gonna just go get bows and arrows and train range and come back to you. Get off of me, I don't wanna die. Uh, back to the drawing board. We'll be back for that bear. So, I know this is like really lame, but I got a rake. I just bought one from farmer and I did that a while ago and I don't know I just felt like that would be a good way to get a couple farming levels because walking around the entire game there are a ton of farming patches and you can actually get some decent really low level xp like just from you know raking so I thought that was a good idea it was like 15 gold coins 
All right, so while I'm in Varrock, I got some supplies. I smithed some um, bronze bolts and all of that. Um, I'm going to start getting some mage stuff because I got some money, and I feel like that's a great start. I'm going to buy an air staff because um, I feel like that's the most useful for now. Later, it will probably be the fire staff, but to, get, to, to begin with, we're going to do staff of air. And then we're going to buy some runes and train a little bit of range and mage. And hopefully then kill that bear. Okay, I'm 10 magic. Oh, so I feel like a boss and I'm going to try to kill this bear now. I don't know. I, ha I could unlock Earth Strike. I just, there's got to be a way to save spot this bear. Like, oh God. Oh, I just hit it too. There's got to be. Oh, oh, bro, these plants are dope. Oh! Okay, I didn't know there was a safe spot. I got like all these teas getting ready for this and boom, here we go. So now I can finish Druidic Ritual really, which is nice. Um, and I'll go get the other meats. I, I thought I would need all these teas, but I didn't. So that's pretty good. I didn't level my range yet, but I'll get to that. But I highly recommend that gnome, I mean the security stronghold because that gave me a ton of runes. I bought myself an air staff and just some mine runes and seems pretty great. I haven't bought like any of the other runes, but I guess you don't really need it until the higher levels and stuff like that. So, but yeah, bro, we're going to get this bear meat. Boom.